Hello crafty friends, Evelyn here. Thanks for joining me. I just want to share with you guys my, my um, red truck hack. Um, I had purchased perhaps six months ago, maybe five months ago, I had gone to Dollar Tree and I had found some red trucks. Now, uh, the first truck that I did find was actually green. Um, at that time, I didn't think they were going to carry red trucks, but this was actually the first one that I had purchased. This one was green. What I proceeded to do um, was that I had, um, I bought also some red uh, nail polish right there in the Dollar Tree, and I proceeded to hand paint and cover this uh, red truck, which was pretty good. Uh, when I went back to find more red trucks after I had proceeded to do this, I actually ended up finding some uh, red trucks in the uh, toy section. So these were the ones that um, that I got from the Dollar Tree, like I said. And what I proceeded to do was, um, this one was easier, I didn't have to paint it, it was already red. Um, I covered it with the uh, Christmas Noel um, snow paste. I had gotten this last year from, from Michael's. And I also used my Marquee uh, glitter. And uh, I used just some regular uh, glitter glue. And I just proceeded to, um, to glue on the uh, Christmas tree, add some sparkles and the snow text. What I like about it is how smoothly they run. So I actually ended up making a few of these. Um, I think I have like a total of, of six plus seven plus the green one that ended up being red. So um, that's my hack. So keep an eye out for those, uh, for those red trucks. I also wanna show you guys, share with you guys, let me back it up a little bit. This is my, um, my Christmas card. I decided to go with the uh, red and green this year. So these are my, this is my Christmas card for this year. And um, I haven't mailed them out obviously yet and I haven't signed them, but uh, this is the inside. Um, I used 110 uh, cardstock. So uh, let me also share since um, I have um, everything out, I also finished making some rosettes. I have to say that this one is my favorite. I used some old uh, Grinch cards that I had and I made um, some rosettes. These were made using stickers. For example, this is made out of ribbon. Uh, here is another one that I used some stickles and these were really fun and I like to use the rosettes for uh, for packaging um, Let me also show you these match boxes that I made um, I used uh, this year. I used the Echo Park a very Merry Christmas and uh, one of the um, uh, scrap uh, pages were these um, old antique uh, ads that you would find on the um, Christmas ornaments back in the 50s and 60s. Um, so I just used an old matchbox. I painted it up. And um, as you can see, um, I just, you know, totally, totally changed them. And I was thinking of, of using them as packaging and just adding that that really pretty uh, green tinsel in it. Here is another one. Some of these I've already uh, finished decorating and some I haven't. I made this one. I really like this one with the um, antique ornaments, the glass ornaments. Here is another one that I made. Let's see here, I'm gonna reach over. Here is another one. This one I decorated with flowers. I also used a quick no, not a Cricut, a Sizzix um, die that I had, and I made these really small ones. These small um, boxes. I like to have um, small uh, boxes. So I made this one. Let me see what else I can show you. Oh, and let me just show you some of the, the rosettes on the packaging. So this is just some, some scrap paper that I had. It was from a very old uh, pack, paper pack, recollections paper pack. But look how, how pretty 
how pretty the um, the packaging with the rosettes with the rosettes are. I have to say that I, I really love the uh, Santa images. Those are my favorites, and the gingerbread. And here's another one in green with the Santa. And here's and here is another one. So this is what I've been up to. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my hack. And keep an eye out for those red trucks. Talk to you later.